In a world where every 11-year-old boy plays video games incessantly, one boy who played hour after hour, day after day, every waking minute, broke the mold. His name was Kenny, and on his 12th birthday, he received an awesome frisbee. <laughs> His parents taught him and played with him outside. He liked it and practiced every day. He became very good, and as a side benefit, he could catch anything. Soup, groceries, bottles of water, or anything that could be caught. His nickname was Catch All Kenny, because he could catch it all. People talked about him incessantly. So, you wouldn't believe this. I was watching from across the street as this guy grabbed this lady's purse and he yanked it off of her, knocked her over, and took off down the street. And Ketchall saw the whole thing. He grabbed this old man's cane, made sure the guy was stable, and then flung the cane at the guy who was halfway down the block, knocked him on his butt. Yeah, this guy Ketchall Kenny, I saw him in Central Park the other day. He was giving free Frisbee lessons to everybody. I learned how to do a dually hoop. Kenny coins catchphrases, and one of the most popular ones that he coined was, I'll be back. Until one day, Coach Mustache, who hung out at the local porta potty at the Allenton Park when he was stressed, heard people over-talking about Catch-All Kenny. Hey, have you heard this kid named Kenny? He's like 12, I swear, he catches everything. Kenny? Oh, yeah, I've heard of him. More okay. than heard of him. And hold you right there. You've, you've heard of him, so can I document this for TikTok? Yeah, sure. Okay, no okay. That is. So, guys, I'm sitting here right now with the man who knows about the upcoming star, Kenny. I think Kenny, Kenny Ketchall. About five months back, he was at the state fairgrounds. They had this little display going. Pro hey, guys. Frisbee. Hey, guys, hey. Hey, hey Kyle. Hey, hey. I heard you talk about some guy that throws a lot of frisbees or something. Yeah. Okay. Catches them all, yeah. Wait, what do you know about him? Uh, his name is Kenny. He's like 12, and he kind of just catches everything. And well, every single thing. You can throw anything you want at him. That kid will catch it. Where do I find this guy? This phenom. Um, he's right back there. Excuse me, guys. Hey, kid. Kid. Yeah. Strange man. Kenny, right? Yeah. But hey, anyway, like I'm I said... Coach. They threw 32 frisbees at him all at once. He stop. caught every single one of them. You kept his hand in his pocket the entire time. We're going to sit You're you joking. up. I am not. Kid, let me lead you. I can get you a college scholarship. But he's only 12. We're going to lie and say he's 14. Kenny went on to be a huge star and the most famous frisbee player in the whole United States. The Oachita University Cheetos were back on top. And at the age of 12, Kenny was a huge star. One day, Coach set up an early morning breakfast in Lake Orion, Michigan, with Kenny. He arrived early. It was still dark. He looked at the usual spot for Kenny. He wasn't there. He looked, and he looked, and he looked. And finally... You cannot, you will never believe what I'm doing right now, right now on this corner. Danny, where are you? Darn kid. Hey kid, you can catch anything. Catch this. Danny, where are you? Kenny, Kenny, oh, you were my ticket to the big time. 
dumbass, dumbass, dumbass. Oh, guys, are you, see, are you seeing this right now? Are you seeing this right now? Hi, I'm WRNG reporter Bill Bronze, and I'm here at Hanson's Running Shoes in Lake Orion at the corner of uh, Flint and Broadway, where an errant football fan, a Lions football fan, can you believe that, has thrown a football and knocked Frisbee star Kenny out right to the ground. I guess she threw it because he thought he could catch anything. Well, this is the first thing he's never caught. He's out right now. We interview a few people on the scene. Okay, Bill Bronze back here again, and we're here with uh, the world famous TikTok. Tick, TikTok. I don't say TikTok. I'm not a TikTok person. Uh, what's What's your name on TikTok? My name is Miss Windenbull. Miss Windenbull. Okay, uh, tell us what you saw. So, okay, I was standing on the corner of what is this, South Broadway and something Flint Street. Flint, Flint. Yeah. yeah, Flint. And I'm over there, and I'm trying to do a live for my my followers because I got you know I got a couple million followers on my on my. TikTok, and I see this kid get hit by a football in the head by some, what is it, like a fan? What, what, what's the team? Uh, the, is it the Lions? The Tigers, the Lions, Lions. something like yeah, that. I don't Lions really know fan. what they are. They throw the football or the soccer ball or some, something around, but she threw it, hit this kid in the head, and now he's in the ground, and I caught it on camera. Yeah. Earlier you yeah. said it's got two million views. Yeah, yeah. I got it got me another million followers. So thank you. Sorry, kid, but thank you. Okay. Well, Kenny uh, has been taken to the local hospital to be checked for a concussion, and uh, we'll get back with you later. Thank you, uh, TikTok girl. I forgot what her name was. Thank you, Miss Windenbull. Miss Windenbull. Okay. We talk. We talk to the errant uh, Lions football fan next. Where is she? Uh, She's over. Uh, yeah, I. No, no, you don't have to arrest her. She didn't do it on purpose. Okay. I see they confiscated your football. What were you thinking, ma'am? Well, man, this kid's known as Mr. Catch All. I thought he could catch it. I was on my way to see my kid play a little league game, and uh, I had the football with me. I thought I'd just try it out. You know, I'm a big Lions fan, too, even though they lose all the time. But I hope, I hope every Sunday, then comes that fourth quarter. Down we go. Yeah, but, down, down, down they go. So, they go. so uh, I hear they're not going to press charges because they believe you that it was an accident. Total accident. Total accident. But but, but you've been banned from ever uh, holding a football again. I hear. I that's what they tell me. And some uh, I can't get close to the kid within you know like two miles or something. You know. Okay, there you have it. The Lions fan who has destroyed uh, we think Kenny's uh, frisbee playing career. Up to the coach, find out what happened. Come on, coach, man, he lives a long way away. Hey there, I'm Bill Bronze at the Allenton Park, where uh, we've tracked down coach who ran from the scene of the accident. We've been here three hours. I hope he comes out soon. Oh, there what he the? is, coach. Why did you run? When you gotta go, you gotta go. Well, I, I guess that's fair, and. Uh, Eating popcorn in there. Okay. And uh, what happened? What what happened? Tell us what happened. I don't know. He was unconscious when I found him. After this viral video hit TikTok, Kenny became a TikTok star with the help of Miss Windenbull. I'll tell you, I just caught one of his videos by accident, and I have been obsessed ever since. So, uh, yeah, based on your 100 million uh, TikTok views, uh, we're going to give you a big contract, Lamborghini, anything you want, kid. What do you say? Tempting, but my grandma always says to stay in school, and my mom says that all, all that glitters is not gold. He got his college degree, graduated at the age of 16, married at 21, and has one child of his own so far. <laughs> I'll be back!